Well, it is day three of COP29, and I just got a call from Ambassador number 5,278, Shahu. And he, I met him, obviously, well, as, as he says, because it's tough to remember 9,700 ambassadors. I met him at COP27. And uh, he's going to remind me, hopefully, uh, his name is Mohammed Shihu. I guess Mohammed's his first name. And uh, it looks like he's from Kenya. You know, there was, um, I believe there was like 600 Nigerians uh, uh, contingent you know, in COP27. 44,000 people are uh, attending COP29. Um, last couple of days I've been listening to and uh, streaming speeches from the world leaders. It's been really fantastic. Wonderful speeches calling for um, everyone to curb uh, greenhouse gases. And as you know, my theory on it is if everyone uses a third less of everything, drives a, a third less, buys a third less, uses a third less, uh, we can curb it. And here he is, Shihu, calling in from, uh, yeah, he's actually like Vita. Vita's still not there. She left a day and a half ago. Shihu, welcome to Be Fantastic. Good to see, good to see you once again. You are looking very young, but fantastic. I get younger every day. I don't know what I'm doing right, but. Hello. <laughs> So Vida, you just made a <laughs> that call. That is serious. I I swear to I swear to God Almighty, the time we met, the time we met last two years, and now you are looking very very fresh. I'm good to see you like that. Thank you so but much. But I put more weight. See, I put more weight. Serious weight. I put some weight yes, on. Yes, was so fantastic. As long as you're happy, that's all that matters. Exactly. We are humble. We are all fantastic. All alone. So you just made a call with six others. Was that the COP twenty nine group that you? Did a group call with? Oh, oh yes, just, just from the group that they called me today. Vida, who was at the airport, yes. she left two days ago from Guatemala. She had two 12-hour layovers uh, to get to um, Baku, Azerbaijan, for the conference. The government of, um, of uh, Guatemala, where I'm living now, uh, sent her and her contingency there. Uh, the Ministry of um, Environment Center there. You are still traveling. Tell me about your journey to um, Baku. So, what happened? He's frozen. Shahu, Shahu is frozen. Can you hear me? Well, yeah, that's technology for you, and that's live uh, broadcasting for you. So, you know, as you know, my YouTube channel here, never a second take. I'm not going to re-edit this. If he calls back in, great. If he doesn't, that's what it is. Uh, it was great to see him. I can't wait to hear what he's doing um, or what project he's on. Uh, obviously, he's, um, there's a lot of people are spending a lot of money to uh, to get there, and hopefully he calls back in. Because he had a big smile on his face. That's always nice. Let me see here. Yeah, okay, so I'll, I will, what they call vamp. In show business, it's called vamping when you have to buy time. <laughs> and I can vamp for many, many hours. And I hope my vamping is amusing you because it's, uh, it's all about smiling. And maybe that's why I'm getting younger every day, because I smile a lot. I laugh at life. I laugh at myself. I laugh at everything, because I think it's hilarious what's going on. Uh, it's, it's a little bit sad what's going on. I call it the insanity of humanity. But hopefully, um, Shihu, I, I doubt his name's Shihu. I'll bet his name is Muhammad, and his last name is Shihu. I, I believe that everyone should go by their first names, except me. Everyone except me. <laughs> oh, by the way, another thing I want to report real quick. We hit 1,000 friends on Facebook, Be Fantastic Facebook. So if you haven't uh, joined the, the, the Dr. Fantastic Friend Group, I guess we should call it that. It would be nice if all 9,700 and what is it today? 
every day the number changes. And you're all every ambassador of kindness is listed on worldkindnesslist.com. We are at 9,725, looks like. Who's going to be 9,726? Muhammad, I'm going to call him Muhammad because I believe that's his first name, is 5,278. Let's see what's happening with Muhammad. As I still try to vamp a bit. Let me see. I'll, I'll call him at this point and see, what, see what's going on. Because he called me. And as you know, I'm always available for you. I'm your I'm your life coach. I'm your mentor. I'm your friend. I'm your motivator. I'm your guru. <laughs> I'm your advisor. I'm your your spiritual ba ba ba. Let's see what he says. Let's see if the call comes through. He um obviously is in Africa. I believe it's Kenya. Get that nice hat, garb, and he's not answering. Ah, uh, he's probably lost signal. That happens. That happens. Um, we'll wait. Let's see if he even received the phone. You know, if they have uh, two green, two red, or two blue lines, that means they received it. So he's not even receiving signal right now uh, on WhatsApp. And this is the YouTube channel. So, uh, what else is going on? Let's see if we can um, get some others to join us. You know, I just love talking to myself. <laughs> I'm always talking to myself. You know, I've got, what, 2,100 videos on this channel, and most of them are me talking to myself or, or a camera. And hopefully someone listens. You know, the way I see it, I spend a lot of time professing the three commitments to kindness. And if only one person watches a broadcast, that's fantastic. Let me see. Let me just invite a couple more people in because it's getting lonely here. Um, one love. Let's, let's send out a request to them. I'm going to invite everybody in. Let's see what happens. Uh, that's that's a big organization. Shibu, COP29. I'm going to invite back in again. See who joins us. Uh, let's call in some directors. You get directors. See, basically what happens is you become a, you, if you like what we're doing, you become a member in a group. And if you love what we're doing, then you become, and you want to help, you become an admin to that group. And then if you're thrilled and really want to help change the world, you become a director. You know, the ones that are very successful as admin, which is just inviting people in, become directors. And we're only going to have 195 directors, one from every country. And I'm hoping um, Major General Dillawar, who just posted a very fantastic uh, poem uh, on uh, on our on our, in our groups, will become the um, the director of India with 1.2 billion people. One person is going to be the director, and the director oversees all the city groups in that country. And right now we've got some fantastic directors. Uh, they are from the list is. We've got Shuab from Nigeria. We've got Kiplinger from Kenya. We've got Eugene from Zambia. We've got Moses, who's really doing great. I mean, they're all doing great, but he's from Uganda. He's enlisted 181 orphans to be part of uh, the um, kindness revolution. And they are all listed. For, and remember, your own, it's only your first name. It's only your city you're born in and your country and your number. And if you want to put your profession, I'll put that. And I will. And we also support all our ambassadors, NGOs, humanitarian initiatives, charities, and all the good things they're doing on the foundationforworldharmony.org. Then we have Emmanuel, who's gearing up really nicely in Sierra Leone. Sharif in Somalia, who's doing really, just starting up, doing great. So we are in 142 countries. Luckily, not all 100, we don't have 142 directors, or I wouldn't have time to breathe. But it's going to grow organically. And uh, eventually, uh, like I say, we have members, and we have ambassadors, and we have admin, and we have directors. Then we're going to have what's called the global 
ambassadors, and there's going to be one for each continent. These are directors that are really hit, hitting the wall or hitting the street, doing fantastic by inviting people in. That's a big breath. So it's an ambitious goal I have. You know, um, my wife, my ex-wife, thought I was crazy to go around the world and uh, teach kindness and encourage people to follow the three commitments, and and now it's the the, the kindness revolution. But Steve Jobs said. People who are crazy enough to think they can make a difference in the world are the ones that do. And I am making a difference. And you can ask all my directors, because those are the guys that really spent some time. Because it takes a long time to understand the depth and breadth of the Be Fantastic philosophy, the kindness revolution, which consists of a lot of information. Be Fantastic today is the main site. That's been relaunched. It was dead for a while because of hackers. You know, a lot of people don't like um, people doing kind things. And people look down on people doing kind things. And people don't like free shit. But, you know, I'm sorry. This is free. Uh, and it's just how humans are. They don't respect free. And I can tell you millions of examples on that. But uh, it looks like we lost Shibu Muhammad, unfortunately. That was going to be a, a good call. Because um, it was great to hear from him. You know, and I apologize if you're not hearing from me directly. Uh, if you're watching uh, the YouTube channel or following us on Instagram or or um, uh, Facebook or X or TikTok. Because one, I can't remember everyone. And two, there's not much feedback. I don't get much feedback. But the feedback I do get is fantastic. People really are saying they're enjoying the quotes every day. As you know, I sent out a motivational quote. I also post it on LinkedIn, um, obviously Facebook. Uh, X gets it every time. X is at Dr. Fantastic 1954. We've got some um, ambassadors chiming in with some stuff. Let's see if we can get them on. Let's see if we can get uh, Dr. Samoy on. Okay, I'm going to paste him there. He uh, he's ambassador number nine thousand one hundred and eleven. He just said that's fantastic. Uh, from one of my posts, we got Boya saying that's fantastic. That's, uh, someone from Boya or Boya, um, lady friend in Belize just chimed in. Uh, what else is going on here? Victor uh, from Antigua. Uh, whatever. And um, it's a different big group. There's a, I'm in a, a couple big groups as well where I invite people in to, oh, the prince. Let's see if we can get the prince in here. He's always interesting to talk to. Um, who else is on the line? It's so lonely. Please call me. Oh, there, Moses. Let's get Moses on. Moses, he says, hello, I'm happy. My wife has accepted to share. Ooh. My wife has uh, accepted to share her phone with me after sitting mine. <laughs> okay, let's get him online. He had to give his phone to his daughter because he lost his phone or his daughter lost her phone and she needed it for schooling. You know, uh, I always say that all the answers to everything you want to know is on Google. You don't need to go to school. Uh, and, you know, people don't respect free because Google's free, so they probably don't use it that much. They like to spend money on college and on schools because that's just how humans are. They like to spend money. It's free. Education is free, but you have to want it. You know, I mean, I respect the Asian cultures. They thirst for knowledge. The American culture, they, they, they ditch school. They, they show up late for work. They show up. Uh, and they leave early to work. I mean, it's just, oh, I call it the insanity of humanity. Come on, people, call in. Let's have some conversations. It is, again, November 13th, 2024. Um, live in Antigua, Guatemala. Hoping some of my ambassadors come. This this particular episode was just spurred on because Mohammed called in and he he did a group call uh, and we caught Vita in the airport. Oh man, some people are spending three days or more to get to Baku. 
it, it is far away. I remember when I left Egypt and came to Belize, it was uh, over 30 hours, a couple planes, a boat, a couple buses, some taxis, it was quite a trip. And Belize, I had a fantastic time on Belize. Uh, I put up over 200 Be Kind signs, uh, created the Be Kind sign campaign. People were buying Be Kind signs now in Belize. There's a local making them, making some money. Uh, and uh, people, I'm encouraging poor people around the world to make Be Kind signs because people will buy them, make them from trash, from discarded wood, from palm fronds, from whatever you can paint those six letters on, two words that will save the planet. Um, so this isn't live. Uh, I've been doing some live broadcasting too, but uh, it is live for me because I'm alive. Can you see I'm alive? Actually, that was a great compliment. It's been two years since I saw him. I'm overweight. You can't see it because it's below camera. You know, I've, I've been eating so well because, you know, I'm all by myself traveling the world and living here in Antigua now. Uh, and, you know, I kill a lot of time by cooking. I've got, oh, by the way, I have over 60 episodes uh, of my cooking recipes, which I give for free. Again, it's free. Uh, and it's uh, me teaching you how to cook fast, easy, economical, delicious recipes from all over the world. Over 60 episodes. Actually, there's a lot more than that, but there's 60 on BeFantastic.today, the website. There's also the Be Fantastic Burger Challenge. There's also the, my Ferris wheel. Whenever I see a Ferris wheel as I travel around the world, I jump on it and I make a video. What the hell? You know, it's fun. Got to have fun in life. You know, if you're not having fun in life, you're really blowing it. And a lot of people think that they're going to have fun when they retire. Well, sometimes you don't make it to retirement. My my family, my, my, my parents didn't make it to retirement. They died in their 30s. So you may not make it to retirement. So you got to have fun today. Because what do they say? They say, live every day as though it's your last. Because one day it will be your last. Speaking of last days, make sure that you tell your loved ones that you love them every single day. Kiss your kids. Kiss your kids. Kids who don't want to have their parents kiss them, that means you didn't do the right job by kissing them every day when they're young. If you kiss them every day while they're young, they're going to get used to it, and you can kiss them when they're adults and when they're, they're their own parents. And you have grandkids, and you can kiss them. Lots of kissing. Oh, here's another thing about kissing. I heard that unless you're kissing your loved one for six seconds at a time, it's not a real kiss. It's just a peck. You want to keep your relation going strong? It's called a six-second kiss. Should be called a se seven second kiss because seven is a better number than six. At any rate, so kiss your loved ones long, hard, deep with emotion and love, and your marriage will be will last longer. I give out a lot of advice. Matter of fact, there is a um, segment or there's a category on be fantastic dot today called Ask Doctor Fantastic Anything. People sent in their questions on video. I answered them on video. All sorts of questions about life, love, and the pursuit of happiness. Um, and one of my advices, well, pieces of advice, for a long marriage, for gentlemen, every morning when you wake up, first thing you say to your wife is say, or fiance or girlfriend, I'm sorry, <laughs> because you did something wrong the day before, believe me. And saying you're sorry, eh, it might help, it might help. My wife would never forgive me. I don't care how many times I said I'm sorry. And I did a lot of things. Was I always the most kind person in the world? No. We all make mistakes. But I've made up for it by being the, the ambassador of kindness to planet Earth. And I plan on saving this Earth by killing them with kindness. <laughs> How's that sound? Well, I guess I'm going to sign off for now. No one's calling in. Poor Dr. Fantastic. No one's calling. Everyone's busy. Everyone's doing something. Eight billion people on the planet, um, a thousand of which are friends on Facebook. So there's only um, seven billion nine hundred ninety million nine hundred and nine 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 hundred ninety eight thousand people to go to get them to be friends on Facebook to follow the three commitments to kindness to be part of the kindness revolution. Be kind. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and share. Sharing is caring. Caring is kindness. Kindness leads to happiness. You know, maybe someone needs to hear these kind words today. Maybe someone doesn't, but if they have the time, which nobody has, maybe they'll watch it. And I don't know how many minutes I've been on, but it was, if you're still watching this, you are fantastic. And remember to say the kindness pledge in the mirror, in classrooms, every day. 
Here's how it goes. And repeat after me if you're still watching. I pledge to be kind to and love myself. I pledge to be kind to and strive to love all others. I pledge to be kind to love and respect our Mother Earth. We are all fantastic. You are fantastic. I am fantastic. Build self-confidence, creates energy, fosters um, camaraderie. It does a lot of stuff. And it's it's the goal, it's the global kindness pledge. Please record a selfie doing it, submit it. It's um I post them all on uh, the foundation for worldharmony.org kindness pledge page. And you know, if we all start making the pledge, we're all gonna have a better life. And uh, no one's calling in, so it is what it is. Don't let anything upset you. Am I upset that no one called in? Well, one person did, Mohammed and she who did. Um, no, I'm not upset about that. I'm happy one person called in. And I'm ha happy if you're listening to do it, me this long, which is amazing. You are fantastic. And um, the jingle is fantastic, too. Watch, watch, watch and listen to the Be Fantastic jingle, written by a very famous guy, Jerry, the instant song maker, who made songs instantly on the spot for presidents, for celebrities, for all kind of sorts back in the 40s. He was still alive when he did it for me. Hope he's still alive and kicking because it's a pretty fantastic jingle. Take a look at it. <laughs> 